hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel and happy new year this is the first video i'm going to be recording in the year 2023 thank you guys for always liking sharing and commenting on my videos don't forget to subscribe so i used to attend a christian school in my uh gss1 so in my gss2 i had to come back to my hometown and start going to D for some reasons i told my mom i'm not going to put this again i ought to be free i ought to be at home i ought to be able to speak your and some stores blah blah so then <clears throat> i was enrolled in a new school after exams and uh, the first day the first day the first day that i went to the school uh i was introduced to the class so i was just like introduced to the class like okay you can join the class so somebody somebody told just talk to somebody i don't know they just talked to me i said like, ah see this girl's shoe and obviously is what i was wearing in my former school that i brought to school so it was somehow it was boogie boogie that girl actually said eh, well, boogie boogie i said that means like my shoe is looking some kind of baggy big so i really felt embarrassed i could not stand up from my seat till end of the class like the end and I, I think we closed around two or three three, three o'clock i did not stand i was just there i was just sitting down because i was embarrassed people would start laughing at my shoe and immediately we ended school like this i ran <laughs> and i told my mom to go and get me a because i'm not very that boogie boogie to school again it was the first thing that actually really you know caught me so moving on i started talking to everybody we're having fun in my gss3 this one my gs3 you know when you are moving forward to puberty adolescence blah 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 so girls started wearing bra then this girl told me ah posh they want to go to market we shall link up at the market like they want to go and buy bra blah blah I don't have anything about to wear bra inside, but then I feel intimidated that they said I want to go and buy bra. Cause stay. <laughs> At the end of the day, I said, I don't buy. I ended up buying coste. I think size 32 was the smallest one. I don't know. Then the first day I wore it to school, on Monday, that precious Monday, I don't know who told my friend that I, I, I bought coste. I told everybody that I already bought the brow that everybody was feeling somehow weird that ah you too you 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 won't go stay <laughs> it was not a general thing but we didn't accept that we know that oh okay oh, i actually bought the bra it was really really uncomfortable for me in school on that day because i was feeling weird and from then i did not wear bra till like my ss2 Cause i really don't have what to put inside you guys are not okay, let's i forget there's this story there was a girl in my house that we stayed together neighbor to neighbor i'm older than this girl with like two or three years and this girl told me she she was on her period then i feel really weird i could not go to my mom and tell my mom that ah, why would i better be on the period when i'm even the i was supposed to see my period before that person so it was really really intimidating and weird so i had to go back to the girl how did you see your period what happened when you saw it blah blah i was asking a lot of questions then i ended up buying a sanitary pad when i was not even on my period not even start period yet. i had to wear it because i was feeling weird i told the girl ah, i'm on my period too now i had to wear it to school so throughout the school i was feeling like everybody was looking at me everybody was feeling like ah, i had when after after i feel like after after that it was two or three months after then i saw my period and i felt on a different embarrassing level i feel like everybody's watching me everybody is going to see that i'm on my period everybody is going to every time i'm just checking my my skirt send me to check is this is this thing because it's so much embarrassing so that was another story that i really call me peace and embarrassed another story i remember was a day a teacher caught me cheating i was copying assignment on the teacher's table go 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 i don't even get fear i don't fear so I was just this day. I used to, my my house is close to the school, so I'll be in the school around 
to seven. So I was in the school. Some people heard this. Some people heard the from boarding school. I think on Sunday evening. So I went there to just copy. I don't know what happened to that. To that uncle just came inside. Just came inside. Come on, room bam. Messed me. I was copying assignments. Guess what happened? He did not even beat me. He did not even report me. As soon as from then, every morning I report to his table. Good morning, sir. I will not copy again, sir. Every morning I make sure that he, he, that was that was the punishment. Like every morning I have to report to him that uncle, have you done your assignment? Yes, sir. I will never copy assignment in my life again. Then I will go. That was it. But it was very very embarrassing. It was on a different level of embarrassment. Like really got me pissed. So let me tell you, this is this is this story is emotional. This one I is I'm about to say this one. I'm not going to even expand it on it. I wrote a love letter when I was in SS1 to somebody. Then this letter shall got exposed by uh my friends. Yes, friends have really done me dirty from back. So I got exposed. There's, there's no even they not tell it. The principal or do not anybody they was just like they are going to tell on me i have to all this because i'm this kind of girl that deals with other girls in class i'm not a bully but then i like you know but then since then i was like down low-key because they caught me and the guy the the, the the most embarrassing part was that the guy i wrote this letter to actually saw the letter there, there was some some gram oh oh my god i don't know what to even see there was some blunder in the in the tactical of the messages you understand there's some uh, economics error and some typographical i don't even know hmm oh you bo <laughs> so there's some errors that i i would not be able to even read the, me the message or whatever the letter i wrote myself because this if you ask me to read it now i might decided to just myself because no 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 that's not me that's not me no 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 that's not i have two more i have two more to tell you so this evening i think around four o'clock we used to have like lessons from like three to i think three to five fifty or something then this particular evening i don't know what i what i took whether i, I took pains or something in the morning i don't even know i can't remember because it's very very embarrassing moment of my life i just like to you know do this <laughs> Those ones I used to come silent and used to be very smelly, smelly. Me, I don't know that that day. That thing is going to expose. I'm not going to be a low key. That, that was the way the thing just exploded. In the classroom. What? It is what it is. <laughs> because I cannot start to tell you how I felt that day. I cannot start to tell you guys how I felt that day. It was really messy. Okay. So the last part is very mm, mm. I'll say it's confidential, but then I still have to tell you. It was after my secondary school. Uh it was after my secondary school. You guys can hear me now, but it was inside the school. Yep. Yeah, inside the school. Uh I had my first kiss. Uh, it's not like kiss kiss. It was like a, a food kiss i think that's what they used to call it a food kiss or something on the stairs yeah it was our i think on our validity service or something yeah it should be on the graduation day so i was just going to go down from the hall after everything the whole picture and blah 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 so i was going to go down then i just saw this my, it is my crush is my junior friend but then it's my crush i feel like oh okay oh. uh it just happened like that it was really embarrassing because I've, I've never done something like that. My house was actually pumping, pump, 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 pump. So I felt really wet and happy at the same time. So that was that's, that's, that's all of the story I could remember for now. I have more, but then that like the gist. I was just going to bring you guys a new year gist. And thank you guys for always loving, liking, sharing, commenting all my videos i love you guys may god reward you please don't forget to subscribe today i brought the gist just to bring back the old memories of my secondary school there are more gist and i know you guys have a lot of cheese so you can bring it up on the comment section and let us know what you want us to discuss this year because i'm bringing you 
full force energy this year we're bringing a lot of programs a lot of talks a lot of shows here on my youtube thank you so much love you guys bye bye